US PTA Elite Professional. Today, uh, I will help you to work on a two-handed backhand. For two-handed backhand, um, there is variety of using uh, the grip. Okay, so uh, you can see here uh, you can on, uh, you can use um, Eastern backhand grip to play two-hand backhand. So the knuckle of index finger is on number one, and uh, you see the index finger is higher than other in uh, and then other's finger. You can see a small gap here, and a left hand here on top of the grip. So the idea that is you can see like uh, left hand is on number seven or number six, right? So the knuckle of your uh, your left hand, if if you are a right hand player is on number seven is on number six is okay but right hand on number one okay uh, or you can also uh, you continue to grip for right hand the that is uh, the knuckle of index finger is on number two and heel up hand is on number two and left hand on top of the racket like i mentioned uh, before um, for me uh, continent to grip for um right hand this is um the most uh a popular grip for two-handed backhand here continental grip or you can also use um, eastern forehand grip so the knuckle of index finger is on number three and heel up hand is on number three and left hand on top okay so um, yeah like I said there's variety of uh, using uh, the grip uh, to play two-handed backhand uh, number one, Eastern um, backhand. Number two, continental grip. Uh, or number three, Eastern forehand grip. Okay, just pick up uh, uh, what grip you feel more comfortable to play with. And remember, continental grip is uh, the most uh, popular grip uh, for two hand backhand. You will have a ready position. Make sure you will use a uh, forehand grip um, in uh, the ready position, and then you will change to a uh, backhand grip. Then make a split step right before your opponent hit the ball, and make a unit turn as soon as you can. And then you will use small step to move forward. When you're ready to hit, you make a bigger step forward and point your shoulder to the coming ball. And after that, you will drop the racket under the ball and change for your weight forward. Um, your weight now is on uh, your right knees if you are a right hand player. And then turn your hip and your shoulder to hit the ball. So the contact point is out in front of you but closer to your body uh, than forehand uh, and one hand backhand racket with the vertical face and then the follow through is over your uh, right shoulder if you are a right hand player and keep momentum forward and then um, your left foot will move forward and switch back to your forehand grip be ready to hit the next shot ready position feet wider than shoulder right before your opponent hit the ball you will switch to backhand grip and make a split step and then make a unit turn as soon as you can. Point your shoulder to the coming ball and uh, take the racket back. Okay, use a small step to move to the ball and when you're ready to hit the ball, make a bigger step, take the racket back and change the weight forward to your front legs and drop the racket under the ball and hit the ball. The contact point is out in front and the racket face vertical. And then uh, the follow through, go over your right shoulder and uh, bring your left foot forward for a better balance. And recovery, switch back to a uh, forehand grip to be ready to hit the next shot.
to watch more video you can subscribe uh, my channel um, or if you have any questions so please give me uh, the comment below um, have a good day and uh, good luck to your tennis game <laughs>